Hey everyone, uh, Merry Christmas Eve, uh, Merry Christmas, I uh, hope you all have a great Christmas weekend here, uh, safe and happy, all those good things, friends and family, and uh, from my family to yours, the happiest of holidays this weekend. Listen, um, we had uh, no sports here on Friday, so we're going to give you a Saturday NBA game, uh, the Lakers taking on the Nets. And a brief update, uh, the Hawaii Bowl was canceled between Memphis and Hawaii here on Friday. Uh, COVID is wreaking havoc all over the country. I hope it's not wreaking havoc with you or your families. And, you know, it's affecting all kinds of things, including holiday travel, just all kinds of stuff. And uh, Hawaii backed out here with some players testing positive, apparently. And I just, I woke up early this morning and found out. So we did have a play there. Let's get to it real quick here. Um, no, no games out today. We cash in the NBA. We cash in the uh, uh, college basketball on Thursday. Uh, unfortunately, uh, Jimmy Garoppolo just killed us on Thursday night as we had uh, San Francisco for a smaller three-unit play in the NFL. But uh, damn it. Uh, that being said, we have a two-pack in the NFL on Sunday, including a teaser between both the games and then a side pick in one of the games. On Sunday in the NFL, we have a four-pack of winners for you, including a six-unit top play in the Vikings and Rams game. And then on Monday, the big one, uh, college football game of the year. Eight-unit pick. Eleven weeks, one loss. Top picks, college football. Documented. Probably the best in the country. We're going to nail another one. And then we have bowl on Tuesday, a couple bowls on Tuesday, and we have three bowls on Wednesday with another top play, a six-unit top play in the Oregon-Oklahoma game. So that's what we got on deck. We'll have some uh, NBA and college basketball sprinkled in there as well. Only four college basketball games tomorrow. Probably looking at an NBA play tomorrow as well. If the line holds out and everybody, you don't come up with COVID overnight. So you just got to watch this minute to minute and very fluid. Uh, that being said, um, let's get to this game here. And if you take a look at the rosters for these two teams here tomorrow, it is just a triage unit. It is a mesh unit. Um, you, the, basically, the two stars that are healthy are LeBron James and James Harden. Everybody else, including Durant, Davis, all, all the, the key components surrounding them are all out. And L.A. is laying one. The total is 226. And that total is too high. You've got about 75%, 70% of the stars out in this game. And it's a Christmas Day game. And um, I think the scoring is going to be limited based on the depletion of the rosters. And I think uh, that total, I don't, I mean, I, I did it, you know, six different ways from Sunday, removing some players out and then handicapping the number. And the highest number I could come up with was 217. So, I'm going to take the under Lakers, Nets, Christmas Day, NBA free play, Doc Sports. We got NFL. We got some uh, basketball coming your way on Christmas Day. I hope you and yours have a safe and happy Christmas weekend.